Hey, hey, everybody. So, um, this is Anna Beth with Sending Shoe Boxes, and I'm so excited to be back with a unboxing video. So, this is a Girl 10 to 14 Minnie Mouse shoe box. Been putting this one together for a little while, finally got everything I needed, and ready to show you. So, first, we'll just show you the coloring book. Love sending coloring books. Uh, notebook for school and then this really fun uh, the velvet coloring pages got this from Dollar Tree I thought that was super cute for sending that good old uh, Minnie and Daisy best friends I also have this face mask I just thought this would be so fun and, and so cute to open your sh your shoe box and then this is one of the things on top and then get to see this cute face so cute little face mask I also have a horse puzzle I just liked this puzzle I thought it was really cute pretty and you know horses are always fun I used to always want to ride horses and then my grandmother paid for me to have horse lessons one summer and it was the best thing ever I didn't do it much after that because it, it was expensive, but that was so fun, you know, living out that dream of getting to ride a horse. But yes, yeah, so cute puzzle. I also added in here one of my um, jewelry making uh, kits. So this has the pink and green thread and then lots of beads, some charms, lots of fun beads, all different shapes and sizes. So one of those. I also added, since she's 10 to 14, um, this cool, I, I've told you guys this before, oh I need to take off this sticker. They were a dollar stocking stuffer at Walmart during the Christmas time, but by the time I got them, some some of them I got for 50 cents and then the rest I got for 25 cents. And I got probably 20 plus of these, but this had a lot of mini Mouse colors, the pinks and stuff, so sending her one of those cute little makeup kits this oh we'll do this also one of my um hair accessory bags full of a little bit of everything looking at this i feel like i want to add more to it and i might but it does have everything that i typically put in there we got all the different sizes hair bands um i at least put one scrunchie in each one some clips you never know what kind of hair they have elastics butterfly clips so might add a little bit more it's got some space in there two adorable chapsticks these were also Christmas clearance Minnie Mouse with the cute little lids this fun Minnie Mouse um, popper with a little keychain on it poppets whatever you call those things um, a bar of soap I will be putting this in the bag I have, so I'll do that right after I finish this video. But yeah, so bar of soap. Move this real quick. So this is the um, school supply bag. I, you can probably hear Ashton out there playing and hanging out with his dad. Um, okay. I'm looking because I thought... I could have sworn that I had. I don't, but I will. I'm going to have to put that in there. I usually always send colored pencils, and I'm looking in here. I'm like, where are the colored pencils? Um, but I'll grab some before I put this box up. But yeah, so just the standard, um, the bag. I'll try to just go through this quick because I sort of, I don't always do the same thing, but I have a lot of the same items every time, so I don't want to bore you guys. But yes, pens, pencils, all that you need for school, a box. A small box of crayons, two highlighters, a cute pink pair of scissors, big pink eraser, Let's see. a glue stick, glue stick, and two pencil sharpeners. Now in here, I put, um, I, took, I have one that the necklaces always come in a bag, but the bracelets don't. But I put in a cute set, matching necklace and bracelet 
um, in this, and it's got a mermaid in, so you guys can see this one. Let's see if I can show you. It's got a cute mermaid on it, and I love these. You guys know, because I've said it a million times, but I love these because they're the pull string, so they'll fit all different sizes. And the necklace is the same way. It's got the same pull string, so I like that better than the clasp that that's typically on them, just because, I don't know, I feel like that can break. But, so I've got that little set, and then also in this bag, a lot of fun erasers. Unicorn erasers, got a couple of those. And then these cute little animal erasers. I threw a couple of these in here. Cat, a dog, a, I think that's a dinosaur. And I don't know, some french fries, that's sort of random. But that was what was in the fun eraser um, bin that I have. So all those supplies. And then, and here is the hygiene bag. This, love, love, love this bag. Look how cute this popsicle bag is. So I just thought this was so fun. And it's sort of, you know, it's got the pink, but, and I guess it doesn't exactly have to match anyways. Um, Minnie Mouse, but I just love this bag. This was one of those bags I traded for in the Facebook trading page. So it's a wonderful, wonderful lady traded me for 30 of these bags and she did an amazing job. I absolutely love them. I can't wait to use them in my boxes this year. So in here, there are three pairs of underwear and uh, just a variety of colors and um, you know, there I, I've, um, so ever since we've been watching the Barretto's, I'm pretty sure that's the last name, missionaries, I've been trying to size, do the largest size in the category for my clothes. So, you know, underwear, shirts, pants, whatever I'm sending, dresses, you know, if it's 10 to 14, I'm gonna send what would fit a 14 year old. So even if it's a little big, they can grow into it. But um, I've been trying to do that. So same with the underwear, I've been trying to do the highest size on that scale. Also in the hygiene bag, we have a pair of toothbrushes. We've got a bunch of Band-Aids. Um, a, a red um, comb. And then nail files, a nail clipper, and dental floss. That's what I always like to send. I also have a bag in here with some reusable pads. This is one of those things. There's a few things that I, I need to go and print out a ton of. I'll be doing this for my church um, when we do our Operation Christmas Child meetings, which I talked about in my last video. But I'm going to print out a bunch of the instructions for all these type of things, for like marbles, for um, how to clean your pads, how to use, you know, the reusable pads. Um, okay, I'm back. Sorry, my phone died, but I got it all figured out so I can finish the video. But I was saying that I was going to print out um, instructions to put in all my boxes that I that I'm pre-making, you know, for the channel, uh, before I, you know, we do our big, um, <laughs> that threw me for a loop, my phone. So, um, I'm sorry, before we do our big packing party. So, and then I'll go through all the boxes and anything that I see that's missing, you know, I'll, I'll double check them, like, you know, the instructions. Um, some of them are, uh, no, I think I refilled them all. I went and did a check already for ones that were missing soap. But I'm going to double check just in case. Because for a while we didn't know about the whole soap situation. Now we know soap is good. So, uh, good to send. So, yes. But, yeah. So, that's what I was saying about instructions. But we can keep going. And the next thing I have in the box is this tin that I got from Target um, back towards Christmas. This one, it has some activity sheets, um, stickers. Um, it does... Um, it said, oh, you color the sheet and then you decorate it with stickers. That's what it says. You make like a scene. So I'm going to send this. Plus it's got a fun, really nice tin that they can reuse for something else. Because there's a lot of room left in here. I can, you know, you can sort of feel that there's a lot of space. So who knows? They would make a little trinket box. Another thing. Okay, these sort of go together. But I, here, I'll just pull this out. Got this awesome this was at CVS uh, this is a journal and it's got it's got uh, lined pages but also um, 
I thought it had blank. Oh, yeah, I was going to say some blank pages in the back as well. So you could do different things. You could, you know, draw on, on, in the back. You can write down, you know, what you want to write down in the front. But, yeah, so this really cute Minnie Mouse um, journal, it came in, like, a box set with this. Um, it has, it's hard, sort of hard to see, but it's got a stencil, some Minnie Mouse stickers, um, I also threw in other stickers that I had in here, so it's just sort of chock full of stickers. Some really fun washi tape um, that you use to decorate things. You can decorate the journal. And then it also comes with five different stamps. It comes with a little tiny, I'm sorry, this is sort of hard to see because it's in this back, a little tiny stamp pad. And a really fun, um, I'm going to try to move things aside one of those click pencils with all the different colors. So all this stuff came with this journal, except for these two little things of stickers, but everything else did. So I got this, and it also came with this cute pen. So just a cute little Minnie Mouse pen. So this is a nice little stationery set I'm gonna be sending in this box. I um, This is one of the things I sort of started my box. I saw this for the Christmas last year clearance. And I was like, I've got to make an older girl Minnie Mouse box. So that's where that came in. And then I am sending her a book. I don't know if I just felt like she needed one. I have been getting these. This is a brand new book. You can get these at Hobby Lobby. And they're just on the end cap of uh, one of the aisles. I don't, and it sort of changes. It's not one particular aisle. They'll move it and it'll be somewhere else next time. But every once in a while I'll get these are $1.99. I think that's great for a book. I always try when I do buy books, because I do like to send books. I actually send quite a few books. Like I have a, a huge bin of um, really nice, brand new. I've gotten a couple from other people that, you know, I think they, I don't know where they got it, but they look brand new. I have gotten some used, but I always check all my pages. I check everything, because I don't want to send something that looks like it's been used. You know, I don't want it all creased up and bent. But I got this and um, in here I put a couple extra because you can never have enough stickers for extra sheets of fun stickers but what I like about these books is look I mean they come with this really awesome um, pictures illustrations all about the story the you know just in case they can't read you've got so many fun pictures to look at and you can sort of piece together the adventure that Alice goes on. And, um, you know, there's the tea party. But it's just a really fun take on a classic. They have, um, it says, Treasury of Illustrated Classics. And I've gotten um, The Secret Garden. I've gotten quite a few, a lot. There's a book about pirates, and I can't remember which. Maybe that's Treasure Island. I do go through and... Um, because I like to read. I do go through and try to read some of these books before I send them, uh, just in case. But this one, um, oh, and I think they have like Peter Pan and Aladdin. Maybe they don't have Aladdin. I think they do have Peter Pan. Then we've got like, like I said, The Secret Garden. I love The Secret Garden. Love the book. Love the old movie. And I'm going to do, a, I'm going to be doing a Secret Garden box that I have just been ecstatic about. But yes, so sending this book. But yeah, Hobby Lobby, $1.99. I thought that was pretty good. And oh my goodness. I knew it. I knew they were in there somewhere. I could have sworn I had these. Colored pencils. <laughs> Hiding underneath in between this dress and the washcloths. But here is the dress that I am sending. I got this. Again, I traded for this in a group. And it just cinches to fit. And then they can tie bows on the ends. And how cute will that be? You, know, you can, you know, they all come with a pocket and a cute button. So, sending this dress. And then we have some washcloths. I'm sending these two washcloths, red and white. And last but not least, as per usual, the backpack. So sending a nice cute pink backpack this time. But yeah, so that is my Minnie Mouse 10 to 14 girl box. Can't wait to send it. and so glad I got to show y'all. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you have a great week. 
and um, yeah, let's take a look at everything. I'll lay it all out and let's take a look at what uh, we were able to fit in this box. All right, here's what we were able to fit into our Minnie Mouse uh, shoe box. So lots of fun things. I had so much fun putting this together. Like I said, I've been putting this one together now since I got that notebook in um, December. So finally came together and I love how it turned out. Can't wait for it to bless a sweet girl. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys next time. Have an awesome, fabulous week. I will see you soon with a another um hopefully unboxing so all right bye